you use a lot of social networks? Are you a member of eCademy? Perhaps you're a LinkedIn open networker. Maybe you use FastPitch, Rise, Ching. There's so many online networks now that it's hard to decide which ones that you're going to join and how to make the most of them. For a lot of people, their approach to, to online networks is to play the numbers game. How many connections can I get? I lose count of the number of people that connect with me on Academy or on Facebook or on LinkedIn that I've never heard of, never met before, and I don't know anything about. And if you do take up their invitation to connect, you don't hear from them again. And to me, it just strikes me that I'm just another number. And they're trying their best to get to the top of the tree, the top of the league, when it, when it comes to the number of connections they've got. And their belief is that the more connections you've got, the better a networker you are. I don't share that belief. I'm very focused on the connections I make. I will meet and connect with other people online that I don't know. But I do ex expect to have a conversation to try and build a rapport. I don't find it very fulfilling to agree to be in someone's network and never hear from them again. I always think it's quite a good test to go through your network online and tell yourself without looking at the profile who that person is and how you know them. And what's special about them? What makes them unique? What makes them stand out? Because if you can't do that, how meaningful is that connection? Now, there are people that, that will argue with me. Uh, I've talked about LinkedIn open networkers and their approach is to connect with as many people as possible. And I've heard from more than one person recently that LinkedIn open networkers are actually phenomenally connected people and really useful people to know. Now, I admit I have always written LinkedIn open networkers off of people playing the numbers game. Maybe I'm wrong. And that's something I'm going to go away and investigate. And I'll come back and, and, and give you some more advice on that and give you my thoughts as I find out more. But whatever you do, if you become a LinkedIn open networker, if you go to, become, to, to get into the top 100 in Academy, know why you're doing it and know how powerful and how effective those connections are. Because if there's simply another notch on the bedpost, there's no satisfaction in it.